Do computer science graduates hate self-taught programmers? Let's talk about it. Hey, so my buddy Joe had a video the other day where he was talking about how self-taught programmers were getting a lot of hate from the computer science graduates. And so I was gonna ask, since I being a computer science graduate, I was gonna talk about, well, how I feel on that situation. So if you don't know, I have a computer science degree and I actually have a couple different degrees and I work with people that have degrees and people that don't have degrees. And actually, there's actually inside the work environment, the quality of work from computer science graduates and people without a, a degree at all, they're not very different. Actually, they're about the same. People who have degrees and people don't have degrees, it just varies all over the place. Just because you have a degree doesn't mean you're any better of a programmer than someone without a degree. But let me say one thing. I have seen times where computer science graduates have looked down upon programmers that don't have degrees, but I've actually seen the opposite happen too. You might be talking to someone that doesn't have a degree and somehow, I don't ever bring this up, but somehow sometimes these conversations bring up where people talk about their degrees and the self-taught programmer might get really defensive. They actually, I've had times where self-taught programmers have told me that my degree is worthless or that I wasted a bunch of money or I should have just gone to, to free code camp and code schools or a boot camp and I should have not wasted the four years I did uh, going getting a degree. And of course it goes both ways. There is value in a four year degree. There certainly is. I think there's definitely a stigma nowadays where the job market is getting flooded with people that don't have degrees that are changing professions or they're coming right out of high school and they're really interested in programming computers and they're joining the ranks of developers out there. And for me, for me, I love that. Yeah, that's great. But what I don't love is now how we're emphasizing that degrees aren't important at all. That if someone that's gone and, and taken four years of their life or sometimes eight or six years of their life, if they have a master's degree, somehow that's not worth it or we look down upon those people, I have a problem with that. And I think it's systemic through a lot of these kind of coding boot camps and a lot of these workplaces now where people are thinking, well, these, this person over here that has a degree, they're not worth as much as the person without a degree because that person without a degree worked 10 times harder to be where they're at. In life, there's a certain amount of unfair advantages and having a degree is an unfair advantage. And it's fortunately in this world, if you like it or not, there's a lot of HR managers that will pass on your interview or pass you for getting an interview if you don't have a college degree. So just keep that in mind next time you're applying for a job. Now with all that said, having getting a college degree is not for everyone. Some people in their life can't afford it. Some people in their lives, they're maybe older and they're going back into the workforce or they already have another degree. In that case, getting a computer science degree or if you're an older person and you're trying to get uh, change careers, I don't think that's necessarily as important. But if you're a young person coming right out of high school, get that degree. It's going to help you in the long term. And we shouldn't be making fun of developers that don't have degrees and we shouldn't be putting down and thinking that developers who have degrees wasted their time either. I think there needs to be a symbiotic relationship between programmers that are that have degrees and programmers that don't have degrees. And the most important thing is that when you get to your job that you do work really, really hard, that you don't slack off. You're not watching TV on your phone all the time or watching Netflix on your phone, that you're not goofing off, surfing the web, that you put an honest eight, nine, 10 hours of work in every single day. That's the most important thing. And that you keep working on your craft, no matter if you have a degree or not, that you're going home, you're learning programming languages, and you're continually trying to get better. I think that's way more important than any type of degree. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you find this conversation interesting. If you like this video, click the subscribe button and take care. Bye-bye.